so good to see you all again. Last week we talked about jazz and how eighth notes swing in jazz. Can you do that with me on whatever drum or instrument that you have with you today? One, two, ready, go. We also talked about how in jazz the emphasis of the beat occurs on two and four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Can you do that with me? Ready? Go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. But we didn't just play on two and four the whole time. We also added back our one and three and put a TT on two. If you remember, it sounded like this. when we do that pattern, we like for our two and four to be on something a little bit higher. So if we were playing it on two drums, we'd have a bigger drum and a small drum. Since I only have one, I'm using the middle for my low sound and the rim for my high sound. You can do the same thing on whatever instrument you have. You just have to play with it and find two different sounds. Let's do that one more time. Ta, ti, ti, ta, ta. 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 So we're going to keep those two things today, but we're going to put them into a song. Today, we're going to talk about the blues. Blues is a type of jazz that has a repeating pattern throughout an entire piece. And the repeating pattern comes from the chords. And chords are what we add to a melody to create harmony. So if we have just a melody, it sounds like this. Chords sound like this. is okay on its own, but if we add them together, are built on solfege. So you can see I put our solfege on our xylophone here as well as a set of numbers. When we name chords in music we name them using numbers based on which solfege they start on. So if I have a chord starting on Do I'm going to call it a one chord. If I have a chord starting on Fa I'm going to call it a four chord. And if I have a chord starting on so, I'm going to call it a five chord. In blues, we use do, fa, and so. And the pattern sounds like this. Do, 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 fa, fa, do, do, so, fa, do, do. And that pattern of 12 notes repeats throughout the entire song. If you were listening really hard when I played the chords on the piano, chords aren't just one pitch. Chords actually have three. So again, if I start on Do, to have three pitches in my chord, I take Do, I'm going to skip Re, add a Mi, skip, add a So. So a Do chord or a one chord has a Do, Mi, So. And you play all three of those together. If I want a Fa chord, I have a Fa, La, Do. Fa, La, Do is a Fa chord or a 4 chord. And then lastly, my So chord is So, 
T re, which I didn't have written there, but we know our solfege letter repeats once we get to do again. So that pattern again, do, 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 fa, fa, do, do, so, fa, do, do, and then it repeats. If we were lucky enough to be at school, we would be playing that pattern on our xylophones. So using really horrible xylophone technique, just so you can see, this is my big C, so it's going to be our DO. If we count it up to FA, DO, RE, MI, FA, and SO. So I will be using C, F, and G. DO, 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 FA, FA, DO, DO, SO, FA, DO, DO. And that's our repeat in pattern. Can you say that with me starting on DO? Ready? Go. Do, 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 fa, fa, do, do, so, fa, do, do. And it repeats. So in blues, we don't usually just use one note of our chord. You can play all the chords together. to play what we call block chords, which is where you play all three notes at the same time, like I was just doing. We like to use broken chords instead, and broken chords sound like this. We split up the chord and play one note at a time. We call that a walking bass line. So here's the whole pattern using a walking bass line. Starting on Do. Do, 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 Fa, Fa, Do, Do, So, Fa, Do, Do. And then it would repeat. I'm going to play that bass line one more time, and I want you to tap on two and four. A one, a two, a one, two, three, four. Can you add the TT back in there? So instead of just tapping on two and four, you're going to go ta, ti, ti, ta, 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 ti, ti, ta, ta. Think you can do that? Let's try it. One, two, a one, two, three, four. swinging, you are right. Hopefully you noticed that. Swings. What do you think it would 
would sound like if we didn't swing it? Let's find out. together. We're going to sing the melody and you're going to help me sing hop bunny, hop bunny. We're all going to play the drum part. Ta -ti -ta -ta, ta -ti -ta -ta, ta. And we're going to have our bass line and our melody to play along with us. Let's give it a go and see how it goes. for joining me today. I sure miss you guys' morning hugs. So here's a hug for you. Hopefully we'll get to see each other again soon. If not, stay safe and we'll see you when we see you. Bye guys.